Hey guys, welcome back and hello to you new people too. Today I'm bringing you a review on the Gunas Koi bag. So back in January, I bought the Gunas Koi bag in Navy. I paid $135.95 for it um, with after taxes and shipping because I had a $20 off coupon. I was also recently sent the Koi bag in classic black from Gunas, so I was really thrilled about that. So the Koi vegan luxury handbag is one of the smaller handbags that Gunas offers. It's basically made in a classic quilted style that's reminiscent of a Chanel bag. You can wear it from the short strap if you like, which is how I wore the navy bag for quite some time, or you can leave that strap on as like an extra detail and use the longer strap that comes with it to wear it on the shoulder or as a crossbody bag, which is how I have been wearing it lately. It has the perfect outside access pocket that you can just slide your phone in if you have a large phone like me. This is the Google Pixel XL. And it's a huge phone, so that's where I put it. it. Makes it really easy to get to my phone. It says you can put your keys in here too, but my keys are ginormous. Let me show you my keychain. Like, I really should get rid of everything, but I kind of like having all of the crap on my keychain that I do. I've got my Tokidoki, I've got my Voltaire Daddy, I've got another Tokidoki, I've got um, a little mini Maleficent. So, Really, I only need to have this, which would probably fit, but because I have all of this, oh, and my sugar pill thing, but because I have all of this extra stuff, it doesn't really fit in there. So even though this is a very, very small purse for me, it holds a lot. I was gonna show you what it holds. It holds my small Tokidoki makeup bag, and I'll show you what's in my makeup bag because this is what I had for la out for last weekend. It's got my Kat Von D foundation, my Bare Minerals foundation brush, and Kat Von D Echo for the lips. It can hold my Kindle. It can hold my, my uh, Tokidoki wallet. My hairbrush. Mints. Tampon pad stuff. And a snack bar. I always keep one of these in my purse because I, sometimes I get low blood sugar and I get hangry. This solves it. <laughs> So you can see that the inside is like a light color and it does have an inner zipper pocket right here if you want to stick anything like important. Really what I usually end up sticking in that pocket is like my jewelry if I take it off if I'm going swimming or something. Um, I also sometimes will, sometimes will stick my little spoolies for my lashes in there but that's really what I do with that. So when I want a smaller purse, this is the purse that I reach for. What I really love about it is having this pocket on the front for my phone because it makes it so much easier for me to get in and out of rather than trying to keep my phone in my pocket on my pants. This is actually one of the things that I feel like a lot of the other Gunas purses are lacking. They don't have a pocket like this for your phone, so I love that this purse has it. I also really love that this is great for going from daytime to nighttime because it's a really classic design. I feel like it's an understated and classy so it works with a lot of different outfits. The only thing that I would change about this, if I could change something, is I would change the gold hardware to silver because I prefer silver to gold. So if you were looking for a classic, understated, luxury vegan handbag, I highly recommend the Gunas Koi because I think it's perfect. I mean, it does come in like a ton of different colors, but black is pretty classic. It's a great bag for daily use and it has a lot of everyday functionality. So yeah, I love it. Anyway, what do you think of this bag? Please be sure to let me know in the comments below. If you've liked this review and found it helpful, please give me a thumbs up and share. I love it when you share my videos. And if you haven't already, go ahead and click that subscribe button down below so you don't miss my next video. Thanks so much for watching.